We must not let this prehistoric cave club swinger out of the crater for Pack World's sake and his. Okay, Cersei, I I'll try, but I, I don't have anything to tie him up with. Sure you do, dude. Just use your tongue. Wow, good idea, Spiral. Gross, but smart. Uh, even sounds gross to me, but it could work. Time to panic, as in... With a little help from Grinder and the Cherry Copter! Ha! Grab on and Grinder will fly you back to my laboratory. In stealth mode, of course. If news of a primordial cave orb got out, some not so caring scientist would most likely put the poor prehistoric fellow under a microscope for the rest of his new life. To your latest lame brain plan, you got me gobbled and belched by that walking vacuum clear. Huh? We must be certain that this prehistoric treasure does not fall into the wrong hands. Treasure? Wrong hands? That old goat is singing my song. Well, what are you waiting for? Get out there and steal them for me! Ah, oh, no bad! Uh, two bill ears! What did he say? The guy stinks since he hasn't had a bath in like two million years. Ugh, that might be the most disgusting thing I've ever seen Pac do. Okay, okay. Not, not even, even close. close. And can I have my dog walk? If you mean when can you have your tongue back, I'm hoping Fuzzbits will be able to communicate with the cave lad since Monster is most likely an early derivative of the prehistoric pack language. Of course, I also speak it, but not nearly as well as Fuzzbits. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can get untongue tied now. Our young guest understands we mean him no harm. <laughs> Sorry, Cave Kid. <laughs> Me, Spiral. You. Uh, uh, huh? Uh, uh, Spiral, weird name. Uh. Spirals are really cool. But, hey, wait. You can talk. The Ugg. You don't have to be rude, dude. The Ugg, my name. Oh. Oh. Ooh, you cute. Hubba, hubba. Solyndria, but my friends call me Silly. And I know it's a silly name. Well, the Ugg. Finding yourself in this strange new world, you must have a thousand questions. Uh, one, what for dinner? The Ugg no eat two million years. Oh, our primitive new friend is in luck. Since Grinder went shopping this morning and the fridge and cupboards are stocked full of healthy, yummy foods. <laughs> Sorry, uh, but come on. Pack no eat for two whole hours. <laughs> And that didn't even take the edge off. I'm still famished. So how about we all hit packet in burgers for a real meal? You hold your horses! Uh, 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 we're horses! Doug, no want to uh, uh, be trampled! Relax, Doug. It's just a figure of speech. There aren't any horses in here. I know we can't keep Doug hidden indefinitely, but we need to be extremely careful. Keep a sharp eye on him. Oh, oh, oh. no like that idea. Oh, sorry, just another silly modern expression. No worries, we won't let the cave dude out of our sight. We better not, or he could wind up under a microscope in some twisted scientist's lab. 
Oh, I could really go for a tasty hot dog. The other two. Not so hot, but me eat this one. to draw attention to yourself. Right, just act normal, like us. <laughs> Thanks! Make that normal like the two of us. Come on, let's order! Wait, where's Doug? <laughs> Not good. Very bad, Doug. Oh, ooh, uh, a little tough. <laughs> But not bad. Ha <laughs> ha! Figures this crude weirdo is with the packazoid. Oh, 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 me no like bully. Oh. You totally get how you feel. Skeebel usually has that effect, but in the civilized pack world, we don't resort to violence. Yeah, these days everything is peaceful. <laughs> Except when Netherworld ghosts or monsters attack. But no problem, since we got these new amped up PSCs with super sucking power. And twice the slime storage capacity. <laughs> Stick to the old fashioned way. Golden belch. Oh, yeah. Never fails. Huh. Looks like the rest blew. They aren't the only ones. Dog! There he is! <laughs> Stop squirming, you prehistoric mess! <laughs> you let the uh, go, <laughs> or else! Oh, all right. Like says anything you can do, but go ahead and try. Knock yourself out. Bad idea. Uh, this better. <laughs> Show them. Hey! Now remember, uh, not no fly! <laughs> gotcha! <sighs> Local hero Pac-Man is saving some oh, unimportant citizen. Are you kidding? Pac just saved the one and only prehistoric cave kid ever! Nice going, Spiral. Now every scientist in Pack World knows about Doug. Let's get out of the Put him in the cage. I've got a million of you. Stop it, Pack, take Doug and fly far and fast to you know where. I know, Fuzz Bits. Thanks to my big mouth. The Ugg will never be safe in Pack World again. True, but I'm certain that this young prehistoric rascal would have eventually been found out regardless. Oh, oh, oh. The Ugg, not dig new world. Wish go home own time. <laughs> Me sorry, but food tastes better than no, no preservatives. Why can't he? You used the Packer Genie to take us back in time before. So maybe... We're not talking a couple of decades, more like a couple of million years. Indeed, but I do believe it can be done. However, it'll definitely be extremely risky. Don't think we have any other choice. And then I'll get right to work modifying the Pacatini. Fuzzbits, if you feel this strongly about your new friend, then perhaps you'd like to go live with the Ugg in the time of the Pachasaurus?
You should have enough fuel to make it there and back. If nothing goes wrong. That's a prereq sign if. But here goes. and swiped our ride. The good news is these guys aren't exactly rocket scientists. Stop! There's no free lunch! <laughs> it tastes good. Gotta gotta come up with a plan fast before our ride becomes a game challenge. Or worse, we, we do. Keeper of the flame, but, but always remember to be extremely careful around fire so that no one ever gets burnt. I got that? The uh, Ugg understand. The Ugg also know he, he not lonely cave kid anymore. <laughs> Me, uh, he keep now. Me keep big, green, tasty hair. Look, we don't want to fight, but we really need our ride back. The Ugg know how to handle bully. You, you want to stop them? Okay, knock yourself out. <laughs> Take care of yourself, dog. Thanks for inventing heat. Now the dog not end up burrowing in an ice wall. Cool, cool. Uh, hi, Mr. <laughs> Stacia. 
Imagine how primitive these cave dudes were. We sure have come a long way since then. <laughs> Guess some guys still have a little evolving to do. 